Good morning, folks. James, the uh, shabby tree mechanic, here to guide you the art of respooling. What you will need to complete your task is a Ryobi 18 volt trimmer. I've removed the battery, so that will minimize any kind of chance of injury. And you will need some point zero six five trimmer line, a utility knife, safety glasses, and dexterity. Okay, next we move over here to the trimmer Ryobi 18 volt. Say I have there is a couple of spots where you can You'll have to, on both sides, press, and this comes right out, this cover. And then we have the spool, totally out of line. Okay. I have some .065 line. And what you're, what you're going to want to do is there's a spot. You can see a little hole where the line can go into. You stick it in there. It'll go in there about an inch. And then you'll just start pulling it on there. This truly is an art. And keep pulling it on there. Pulling it on there. One good thing I like about these spools. Is. When you're almost there. There's a couple of places where you can take the line. Like that. Hold it in place. Okay. <clears throat> I had trimmed this earlier. And just in case, if I was going to use this utility knife, always, always cut away from yourself. When you're done using the tool, slide it back. Slide the razor back in place. Everything is safe. Oh. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and look for the hole, which there's one right over here, and we'll just go ahead, feed that in there. Like I say, it's truly an art form, and anyone who says that it is not, has not respooled. Are. And then this top is going to go right in here. Just like that. And we are done. That was pretty simple. And I'm uninjured. And that is a really good thing. I'll be making a new video in the future. So make sure you subscribe and like. Until next time, be safe, my friends.